James Kaufman, World News Report, today, February 4th, 2025. God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. Ladies and gentlemen, JPL has announced that we have a space rock inbound for 2032 with a probability of hitting Earth. It's a very large space rock, somewhere between 130 and 330 feet, meaning they don't know much about this space rock at all. It has flown by Earth this past year in 2024. I do have all the information on it. They're only giving it a 1.2% chance of impact of Earth. I will say that uh, the numbers on the close approach look like a direct hit over at JPL. The name of this asteroid, 2024 YR4. 2024 YR4. And right now it merits attention. Merits attention. And they could possibly try to redirect this asteroid. Let's take a look at the information associated with this uh, space rock. All right, I did find 2024 YR4 at the JPL database. And this is its basic diagram here. And currently, it's nowhere near Earth. It's actually right there. So Earth is the blue circle, if you will. Quite a bit away from Earth, but they believe either during the next pass or after that we're going to see an impact let's get some details here all right taking a look at some miscellaneous details here that arc spent 41 days 294 observations bringing the condition code way down to a five meaning they seem to know where this is headed they have put someone in charge of this rock. I've never seen that occur before. So this is coming from JPL, Condition Code 5, about as low as I've seen. And it's somewhere between 130 and 330 feet in diameter. Let's take a look at the close approach data. So what we're looking at here is it missed us December 25th here uh, and it wasn't too too close but definitely definitely too close for comfort you can see this here this entry December 25th Christmas the Christmas Day asteroid that was inbound and with that said the next pass is going to be 2028 here not very close to the Earth again, but in 2032, we see this number here. Uh, first off, below that, look how close it is to the moon. Point zero 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 one. It's the minimum distance right now. But above it, well, what does that mean? Well, actually, I had to Google it, and that's going to be a direct impact way too close for comfort let's take a look at what that means all right so i converted 4.9 e minus 6 to a number and i got point zero 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 as in five zeros and a four nine which would be a direct hit of earth and that would be a very sizable rock especially if it's towards the upper end of the estimates i.e 330 feet don't know if it would be a planet killer i do know that they're talking about already starting to try to redirect the rock that that is a close one folks let's get some miles for you guys and here you go, astronomical units, two miles, 455 miles measured from the center of Earth, not from the surface, the center. 
which means this is more than a direct hit. Although they're only giving it a 1.2% chance of hitting Earth currently. Again, JPL is talking about trying to redirect this rock. This looks like it's coming in for a direct hit in 2032. Looks like we're talking about December 22nd, 2032. And there's, there's the dangerous number there. 455 miles. God bless you and yours, folks. Let's hope they get it redirected or they're incorrect. Although that condition code is getting, getting very low and they've got plenty of observations on this thing. God bless. Share, subscribe. Always remember, anything's possible. Bizarro world.